at the lizard, man. Look at the lizard. Uh -huh. <laughs> One more bong while I get my mind back. I don't even know what year it is. I gotta get a grip, man. Beauty is everywhere, man. I gotta get it together, man. I gotta get it together. You gotta listen to me, man. Strawberry feels forever. Nobody knows where we're at. These are my children. You touched me. You changed my life. You turned me into what I am today. Rex. Rex Ramron. Listen to me. Yeah, I'm an artist and I made some films. But let me tell you something. My childhood was terrible. And I didn't know what I was going to do. In fact, I didn't even know if I wanted to be in this world. And then I saw a shooting star. And I realized that my purpose in life was to make films. And maybe, somehow, I can make people happy. Because I realized how this world is all crazy, man. People aren't happy. All these things going on. Earthquakes, fires, terrorists, all this shit going on. And I thought maybe if I make some movies and I can entertain the world with my movies, I've fulfilled my purpose. So what I want you to do, Rex, is I want you to go out in the world and be who you are and be an artist and live true to that. No matter what anybody says, keep creating your art. Keep doing it, no matter what. Do it! <laughs> There are a lot of disturbed people on this planet, as you know. Unidentified flying object on the horizon. Do you read me over? Some of you out there, I know I like to personally. I can take a little snort before we make the cup, you know? Just a little stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, believe it or not, I, I, I want him. Yeah, this is going to be Dennis's big break. It's going to be a groundbreaking part. I've written the script precisely for him, and Dennis is the perfect guy for it. Yeah, this movie's going to put him on the map. Do I look hostile? No, but your people are. i got to finish my mission here. Air, it's different from our planet. I feel like something's going to overcome. The temple. And what is this? What is this? Oh no. What is it? Do not touch that. If you touch that, don't understand what will happen. What is it? I hear a noise. Get that girl! Go! Daisy! Daisy, where are you? Oh my god! Ah! No! Daisy! Come back! I killed a lot of people today, and I don't know why, but I still want to tell you, just don't be afraid of me, because if you will, you will die. You better not harm me, or I will freeze you. I promise he will not mess with me anymore. Because you are chosen, so you must get on with your work, yeah. as I say. I must go. I must get on with my work. Thank you, you very much, Mr. Get on Spaceman. with your work. Thank you very much. John Rossmore. You will be okay. Go in peace. Eat lots of ice cream and do your work. Thank you, Mr. Spaceman. You've been a real inspiration. I can't tell you how much you've affected me. Thank you very much. I must go now. I've got a lot of work. Goodbye, Mr. Spaceman. Goodbye, John Ross Moore. Hope to see you again. Goodbye, John Ross Moore. I'm, I'm, I'm on the list, you know, and I think I'm near the top. But I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm sending him letters and stuff, and I really think that it's destiny. Are you fucking lost your mind? No, really. Do you think he's cool? Have you yeah, seen Blue Volva? I like Vova? the fact that he Blue Volva. 
Blue Velvet. <laughs> what are you talking about? Who's David Lynch? The director. He made, you know, so many movies. Dune, Blue Velvet, Lost Highway. Yeah, yeah. Hi, my name is Dennis Woodruff, and I'm a documentary filmmaker. As incredible as it seems and sounds, a spaceman has taken my other Dennis Woodruff car and is driving around in the city and has been spotted in different locations all over the country. Hey, what are you doing? How are you doing? <laughs> What's your name? Yeah, I'm Dennis Woodruff. Hi, I think I've seen you before. I was wondering if you knew anything about the controversial new epidemic in Hollywood about midget porn that's sweeping the industry. It's all over the internet. Midgets are dropping off their little DVDs at people's house at nighttime <laughs> all over the area, running around <laughs> like little bandits giving people DVDs. Well, that's hot. Where are they? I want one. The, the leader of the planet, Ray, is Daniels. And he has came, he has crashed on our earth um, in 1950s, 1960s, I forgot when, the Roswell uh, incident. That spaceship comes from the planet Ray. This is Nina Hagen. On Rad TV. On Rad TV. Rad TV. Rad TV. Rad TV. Who's Nina Hagen? I'm not Who's Nina, Nina Hagen? Hagen. I'm not Nina Hagen. This woman looks a lot like Nina Hagen. My name is Lori, okay? She says her name is Lori. Lori she Lane. looks a lot like Nina Hagen and she acts a lot like Nina Hagen, but she says her name is Lori. Watch where you're walking. Thank you very much. What are you? I'm a spaceman. <laughs> I love spacemen. Look, if you need my services, I'm the best in town. For what? Uh, I'm a cold girl. Cold girl? A cold girl. Call me and you will find out. <laughs> I don't know if I need your services, but I will keep your card, cold girl. I like your dog. Oh yes, he's very oh. playful and furry. <laughs> I don't mean that one. Oh. Cowboy. Uh. <laughs> okay, I must go now. Oh. Coming. I am very psychic. And... My ruling planets told me you'd be coming soon. And who's this? Meow, 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 meow. Meow, meow. I am the rabbit. I am the rabbit man. <laughs>
familiar. Do I know you from somewhere? I, I'm, I'm here from outer space. Are you the, the spaceman that everyone's been talking about, the one that's been walking around Hollywood lately? It, it must be. I think I'm the only spaceman on your planet. Well, do you want to know something funny? Funny? Like, ha, ha, ha? Kind of. Yes. Well, it just so happens that I've always dreamt about meeting a spaceman and one day running away with him back to his planet. Really? Yeah. That's part of my mission here is to find women to breed on our planet. They've all become lesbians. And you mean you would want to have babies too? Yes, babies. Little space babies. Stupid, where's the beef? Where's the beef? Where's the beef? <laughs> Come to me, David. You must hear me, David. David. Yes, it is me, David. Wake up, guardian angel of David Lynch. You have no messages. How are you today? Hi there, Dennis. Wow, Cloris Leachman, you're a big star. How you been? Excellent. Um, what have you been up to? Oh, I'm doing a one-woman show. Mm -hmm. I'm learning my lines right now and having a cup of hot chocolate. Uh huh. You have what? a cute dog. A you know, I, I want to I want to be a great actor like you. And do you give me any like advice on you know I'm trying to study my craft at UCLA? Well, I just think I have a funny bone. And so a lot of it's kind of silly, but but it tickles you, I think. It can. <clears throat> um, you know, comedy is it's either in your soul or it's not, right? I mean, it's, it's actually a very difficult art form, isn't it? To me, it is. I don't think so. Uh-uh. <laughs> quick, 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 bye. Okay. Behind these closed gates. Who's out there with them? Who are they going to remember? Me. That's right. Me too. Thanks. Did it! Hey, how are you, brother? Ah. Hollywood! Hire me, Dennis Brooker, up to your next movie, TV show, rap video, whatever it may be. Hi, how are you? Dennis Woodruff is actually a descendant of the ant people, so I highly recommend that you stay away from him as far away as possible, or you too will become an ant. Hi. Um, my name is Dennis Woodruff, and I'm an actor, and I'd like you to join my personal fan club. And one Can I see your uh, tattoo thing? We all got one. Turn around, Brie. And then I got wow. wow, those are really great tattoos. Oh, yeah. That's the henna stuff, right? Yeah. yeah. Those are cool. Did you get one, too? No. They oh. spent my wad. Okay, do you want to <laughs> uh, Do you want to take a picture, or do you have a camera? No, or you just no, stop by to say hi? Drying off. So they're drying off their tattoos. He's getting mobbed by all his fans. See, look at <laughs> See? Techno. Technotronic. Oh, wait till you hear the soundtrack for this movie. Really? It's just going to blow your mind. Yeah. It all started when I was a little kid. I had all these funny ideas about my life, and I thought I was an alien. And now that I have Tuffy, I feel like I'm not lonely anymore, and I could really have a happy life. 
and I have these ideas, delusions about being a famous movie star. And I was wondering if maybe it's my destiny to be the greatest movie star that ever lived. Hey, boy! Hey, boy! Come on, boy! It's going to walk! It's going to walk! Calm down! Oh. Go! Wait, let me put it over your head. Let me put it over your head. Spirit, if you are among us, make yourself be known. Chloe? Be gone! Christ compels you! Get out of her! Everything's fine. She can't hurt anyone anymore. Give me my baby! You can never lose concentration of your goal, your destiny, to make the best TV show ever. No matter what, I'll climb any mountain. I'll drive from here to Cucamonga, to Taiwan, to the jungles of Africa. If I can just make the best number one TV show, I might even win an Emmy, man. I might win an Emmy! Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, I might! Does size matter uh, in, a, in a relationship? Um, yeah. yeah. Why, why does it matter? I think size is good, you know. Normal to above average would be good. If you're below average, it's a little turn off, I believe. Mr. John Void, how are you today, sir? I'm great, Dennis. How are you? You're always good. You're a wonderful guy. Um, my question for you, sir, is if I gave you a time machine and you could go backwards or forwards in time, anywhere, anywhere in the universe, what year would you go to and what would you do when you get there? Well, I tell you what I would do, Dennis. I would go back to some of the decisions I made in my own life and I'd change them. According to my current calculations, I'd like to be ahead of my time. According to my time, dimension, 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 dimensional code, I might be in another dimension. I am Uriel, and we are Unarius, and preparing the Earth people for the great space fleet landing, the starship landing in 2001. The future of the Earth world is positive. Let's find Unarius. Yeah. All right. I love them. I love them. They're my favorite band. What do you get when you get uh, a starving clown from Ethiopia? I don't know. Me. <laughs> that was so That's stupid. Pretty good. You know, speaking of hungry, I'm gonna see if I can get me a bagel out in coffee bean. Okay. You take care, Dennis. Okay. See ya. Okay. Bye. <laughs> You're on the Dennis Woodruff experience. Woo! Yeah. I'm gonna tell save everybody. this. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you rock, dude! Well, you know what? We're gonna... This is the first step, okay? Look at that. Look at that! You did it! Good work! Thank you. Good work. Now, let's just start with some questions, okay? Tell me a little bit about your childhood. Oh, God. It was terrible. My mother used to lock me in a closet for days, and she'd feed me bread and beans every day i couldn't uh, uh, stand excuse it excuse me okay look every time i come in here somebody is talking about uh, oh my mother did this my mother did that my mother i mean come on it's not all the mother's faults okay <laughs> excuse me i'm spaceman i need your help girls oh, no, no wait no. i won't hurt you i won't hurt you no i won't hurt you but girls, wait! No. They're all far, far away. You know you can never come back. You know you can never come back. 
<laughs> I need to get back where I came from. I really don't think I belong here. If I knew where I was, I'd be there. I know I can make it back. I want to make movies. I know I can find my way back. I'm the gold spender, spend the golden web. I catch you, baby, make you stand on your head. You said, yo, no more talk, you're no ape. You must be a creature from outer space, huh? Hurrah! Yeah. What is what? I don't know. Jesus! I've watched them many times, I think lots of people have. Uh, big fan, love, uh, love to work in all sorts of films. Uh, like I said, semi-retired, so if anybody can think of something for me to do besides this, uh, give me a ring, I'm in the book. No, but like you were in all the Warhol, like a lot of, how many Warhol movies were you in, Joe? Uh, more than one. Just don't, just don't go up to David Lynch. Don't find his. Don't send him letters. Just you know, just be letters. normal. You be don't normal. think I should send him? Don't, letters? don't. Are you okay, kidding? I won't. Are you, are you, I won't. Is this a joke? No, I won't. I promise. Right. I would never send him a letter. What good would that do? Worth looking into it. I want to be in the next David Lynch movie. In and fact, I, and I think that I want to be in all of his movies. Mm -hmm. I want to be in all of his movies from now on. I, I'll, I'll like sweep the floors, I'll do anything. You should. I will. He'll do, do, do it. David Lynch. Stop with the David Lynch. Why? Stop. He's, I'm not Stop. doing anything wrong. It's a lost highway, Dennis. It's a lost highway. Yeah, Dennis, I've already called the cops. If, I, if you don't get away from here, I'm going to shoot you with the bow and arrow right in your chest. It's these cheap cigarettes. Yeah. Yeah. I usually smoke Dunhill, but they were out of them, so I bought these Winstons. I just thought I'd do my audition here at Taco Bell in Hollywood. <laughs>
toilet paper and cigarettes are two things that you should not scrimp on. Yeah, how do you like my new couch? I mean, it's, I um, feel it. It's really, really nice. comfortable. So do you have any of the movies that you made, like here? Can I watch them? Well, I uh, most of my movies are being looked at right now by distributors and they're scattered all over the world and the reality is I keep them in a vault. Uh, I think that Howard Stern is a pervert. Yeah, no, well, it, it's, it's a device. Hey, it's a you device. It's a you don't agree with me, but I know. think they use it as a device, sex, because it is it is a taboo that takes people's guard down and now, then you actually get a real moment. A pervert. Well, yeah, clearly. He is. I think. I think he. I'm an 80 year old man with a six. Foot I think he's a bigger, uh, bigger pervert than than Howard Look, Stern. Look, let's say it the way Howard is. Stern is a pervert. I think he's attempting he to. He's a pervert that gets paid. No, for. no, Dennis. I think he's attempting to to get real moments, real right. conversation going. And you know, sometimes well, isn't if you start talking. What all perverts do? No, no. I'm, I'm just saying he's trying to kept, let people let their guard down. Like when well, he's that's got, okay. when, he's, when he's got Paul McCartney on the show. And he's asking him about like whether he's had anal sex with his one-legged wife. I mean, you know you're <laughs> that's, attempting that's rude. to get a reaction. <laughs> that's rude. I wouldn't say that. It's your audition. Hi, I'm Brianna Lane, and everyone should hire me as an actress because I'm fabulous. My outfit uh, is sort of fabulous today. I'm going to the beach, but um, not what I usually wear. Um, okay, that was awkward. And um, tell Mr. Spielberg you're ready for your close-up. Mr. Spielberg, I'm ready for my close-up. Ne prendra jamais le sol des générations à venir. Empêchez-les de nous voir. Ne leur dites pas ce que nous faisons. Sont cela les paroles des cadres et des syndicats les plus puissants du monde? The art to curb painting is you have to quickly paint right over the white with the opposite color. That in itself blows people's mind how I do that. I'm Spaceman. I want to go somewhere. The Earth's atmosphere is affecting my hair and my eyes. Yeah, this is David Lynch. Uh, I got this guy who's uh He's harassing me. He's sending me videos. He's sending me letters. The guy's driving me nuts. He doesn't need to hire any more actors, just me. I'm, I'm, I'm on the list, you know? I'm losing touch, touch. I'm losing real touch with real reality. Action. This concludes another edition of the Dennis Woodruff Experience, Volume 4. See ya. Bye!